to carrying on with this video. Um, where was I? I was just looking at these, just checking the knots, just looking at those. Stitching looks fine along here. It looks like a, a bit of a braid. Yep, <coughs> doesn't stand out horribly. Nothing's there. Looks okay. Like <coughs> Smells good. Again, a nice little butterfly picture. I didn't really realise it looks so much like a butterfly, but... Until you ordered it. What can I say? There we go. We'll leave that there. Right now down to the... Oh, right. Wow, that's big. Well, the always supposed to be big. Hmm. Maybe not as thick or as in this sort of width. Up here, definitely not as thick as my previous set. Um, but then, do you need somebody to be, do you need it to be that thick up there? Nice scalloping detail here, as you can see. Um, there's like a star pattern on there. We've got there. Yep. There's like a star stitch there. Yes. And you've got these parts which will have to be cut. Uh, leather here. Again, this square stitching. I hope you can see that there. Properly. Yep. They can see. Um, it's good blue. And also there's a pattern up there. Yep. With square stitching. Okay. There you go. One, two, three, four, five, two, four, six. Six there. I can't remember how many I have from my old set. Don't think it's any significance or detail. Um, it feels actually reasonable weight, so maybe they've just got the... It feels reasonable thickness here. Um, it's just maybe this part up here, not as thick as I'm used to. This part here I'm feeling. Um, you've got some nice pattern details here, okay. material. The hemo are stitched together. Why are you cutting it? Because they're just tacked together. Okay, cool. Now, how long is that? It's quite long. As you can see. Longer than his arm. Yeah. Yeah, there's a... It's definitely longer than my arm. Yes, definitely. Um, I don't know if you can see this piece of material here. Mm-hmm. Um, comes all the way down here and actually stops here. So we're actually all the way along the hemo. <coughs> now, you can see some strength, some stitching there to make it nice and strong. Um, cutting off these little buttons. Not really buttons, the bits of leather, I think. Yeah, I think. Or whatever. Just so it all comes apart now. Hmm. There you go. There's the monogram, maker's monogram. No, I don't know what that means. It's because you can't um, read Japanese. So yeah, that looks quite nice. Nice details. Um, not sure how it, we'll see how it holds up to where I'm knocking about. And that's basically it. The box is empty. Um, let's have a look at these Hemo. I should have. Hmm. 
that's interesting. I've got two sets of hemo. Now, let's open them up. And see what they look like. And by my simple maths. Wow. Oh, good. So, we've got two for the dial hemo that go on the bottom. And two, again, dial hemo that go at the top. I feel... I feel okay. I'm not saying the feel the best. Um, not that I've ever used silk chemo. Not, not that fussed with it. Never tried them. And these are the men chemo. As you can see, nice, good and long. Lots of blue. And there we go. Okay. I think that's basically it at the moment. Yep. Um, I'm going to put it all together. Put it on. And then we can see it's blue. Um, oh. I hope you enjoyed that. As I say, um, I've bought equipment from Kendo Star a few times. But I've never actually... Um, I'm definitely not... It's not paid promotion or anything like that. This is just a... I'm a kendo player, um, been playing a few years, probably not, not that good, um, but I enjoy it. Yes, I said the enjoy word, um, but I didn't, ne not necessarily fun, but I do enjoy it. Um, it's an interesting, interesting experience and a lot of learning in there. Hope you enjoyed this. Uh, Stay safe, everybody, um, and try and get some practice in, uh, even if it's just practicing your saburi at home. All right, and see you then. Bye.